Hey everybody, welcome back. My name's Rowan and we're playing Dragon Age 2. Uh, we just finished with the quest, the ma uh, Wayward Sun, I believe it's called. Um, no, maybe. Something about the Magistrate. Anyway, the Magistrate sent us to, to take a escaped killer into custody and we arrived at the ruin that he was hiding in only to find out that apparently it was a killer of elven children and then when we went in to confront him we rescued an elven child and only found out that the killer himself was actually the magistrate's son interesting twist there we ended up taking uh, killing him putting him at him out of his misery he thought he was being possessed by demons and uh, killing these elven children because of how beauty beautiful they were so yeah not not possessed by demons just a serial killer uh, my companions that were with me approved and we got through it relatively easily so anyway let's see where we're gonna go to next here let's go to the wounded coast it looks like Or we can do Wayward Son. Wayward Son is the quest with uh, Fainreel, the elf who's having nightmares. Um, that's right. Okay, so we still have some quests to do before we can finish. Um, let's go to the Wounded Coast and kind of clear out that area. We haven't been there yet, I think. So be a good idea to get that over with and clear the hell out of that area. Alright, so what do we know about the Wounded Coast? We know that there are Talvashoth, which are basically dishonored mercenary Kunari that are running around. Uh, there's also some probably bandits here. Uh, let me think. We also have Sebastian, the Prince of Starkhaven. If I remember correctly, there are some mercenary men who are here that we have to kill on behalf of Sebastian as well. Yeah, those guys. And those are the Talbashaw. All right, so we're going to go do... We're You're gonna so go, lucky. Oh, hold up. How do you figure? I would have loved to have a brother and a mother and an uncle. It must be wonderful. You'd never be alone. It is wonderful. Although it might be better without Uncle Gamlin. <laughs> we give him too much shit. Maybe we should cut Uncle Gamlin on a little slack, huh? So it be Actually, now that we're back to killing people, let's uh, swap our weapons out a little bit, huh?
There we go. That quest is finished. Alright, we've dealt with all of the Flint Company, and now we can go back to the uh, to Sebastian and let him know that his family has been mostly revenged. Uh, avenged, excuse me. But before we do that, let's go around and kill some Kadari. Huh. Excuse me. Sorry, guys, it's late here. this got a quest up here huh Kill that uh, that mage. Oh, good. Anybody else we need to die? We need to kill. Oh, there's some Mabari. Aveline, time for you to run, lady. We're going to have to... Be creative. Do you think oh, that's I'm firing. We have no other potion that's going to help us here. What are you doing, girl? Run. Could have gone worse, I guess.
That should do it. Grey Lord document. Avernus's experimental draft. Ah, that's because we did the first game. The DLC in the first game transferred to the DLC in the second game. Nice. Or rather, to the second game, not the DLC. Got some free attribute points. Very cool. Messages for the Wardens. During the day, deliver the Grey Warden letters to a dead drop near the foundries in Lowtown. Probably. Pay to have them returned. Hey, there's more down there. More bandits. Here we go. Might as well return <laughs> return to this area just to make sure we didn't miss anything. We had to backtrack this way already, so. I prefer the city. It's more... ordered. I knew this! <laughs> yeah, we killed those mages pretty quick. Kill 
Couple of those apostates, huh? See all these little secret hidey places. Secret hidey holes. Can't we talk about this? No? All right, let's see what's going on over here, huh? Elves. Do you even know her name, Shem? No? It's Denyla. She's dead. And you killed her. I was a beast then. A werewolf. I did many terrible things. I... I'm sorry. Sorry does not bring my mother back. I was a victim too, Elf. Of Zafrian's vengeance. Stranger, please calm her down. Did I hear you right? You're a werewolf. I was one, but no longer. Her Dalish Keeper cursed some humans with lycanthropy long ago. The disease spread over the years. But the hero of Ferelden freed us. He was cursed. You can't blame him for that. You stand up for him? Fine. Then you will die for him. Uh, Hopefully none of these people are part of Meryl's clan. Jeez. Oh, snap. There's an assassin. We're gonna have to kill that assassin. Oh. Okay, I'll take it. Wow, man, they just got nuked. Gosh, she does so much damage. It didn't have to come to this. Take this. And thanks. Sheesh. You go again. Get back. Oh. 
a lot of immunities there. Glitter dust. Oh, okay, so it's like an alchemy regent, I guess. Reagent. I want to call it Regent. I want to pronounce it Regent, but I think it's Reagent. As well explore all of it, huh? We get to go down here at some point. Sarabas, that is a Talvashoth mage. Yeah, we're gonna have to take him out as soon as possible. They are not. These fights were a, a hell of a lot harder on, on other playthroughs. Like, that Sarah boss always murdered me. This is what happens when you, uh... When you build for crowd control and stuff like that. The game gets a lot easier. A particularly strong tincture of rose hip and goose shit. <laughs> a full remedy for an embarrassing rash, the label says its intended recipient was Dalian Shaw of Darktown.
on your guard. Thanks for the warning, I guess. Well, there's an exit this way, apparently. I'm sure we're not missing any loot, though. No, no loot. I guess the rest of the Talvashoth are up this way. No further, human. Talvashoth control these passages. Ambushes are usually quieter, Kunari. I did not intend to ambush. I expected to warn a caravan, but you are not helpless. The path ahead is littered with my kind. If you are as skilled as you look, it would please me if you killed them. And I should trust you. I have no history of betraying your people, only my own. I did not like my role, so I left the queue. I do not wish to be a murdering thief, so I left these Talvashov to warn their victims. You are no victim, so now I will leave. If they have offended you so much, help me go after them. But I am worse. What? They don't want to raise their swords for coin, so they murder and steal. They cling to the honor they held under the cune. My sword means nothing. I will sell it and myself as mercenary. Kunare would say I am worse. Do I really have to convince you to do the right thing? I have already done more than was demanded, by my own choice. You have my word of caution, human. Heed it or do not. As twisted as their horns. Yeah, they're definitely weird. Alright, we're gonna have to t deal with them if they're uh, attacking travelers on the coast. Ready, they come. Not one too bad. There's more though. I'm out of breath. 
That was exciting. Get ready! Looks like we actually have a cave to go through this time. I think I remember this cave too. This is a very difficult fight. There's another Sarah boss in here. I think we can do it though. With this group, I think we've got this. Yet another cave. Recycled assets, too. Probably one of the biggest complaints about this game was the recycled assets. Like, where they just constantly use the same exact um, caves. You know, even though they were supposedly different locations, they all look the same.
understand. Ready, they come. go I don't think it's over <laughs> although I will admit that Talvasha uh, officer was pretty hardcore man he had a lot of health And all the little twists and turns. Never know what you're gonna miss unless you look everywhere. You can't actually go there. Watch your step. Oh boy. I almost hit that. All set. For that, that's it.
that it? I know there's more. There's the Sarah box. Yeah, see how much health that thing's taken? There's no way around that one, man. But they're immune to electricity. Yeah, we can't win this. It's her by herself now. Damn. <laughs> you just got owned. That Sarah boss is like hardcore, man. They're overpowered. Like, crazy overpowered. Alright, at least we saved it, like, before going over there. We gotta be able to get, uh, pick that Sarah boss out, um, before it's, you know, before it can really do much damage to us. Last thought of I have anything to say about it. see the Sarah boss. Okay, we're gonna lure them out. My poor dog. to find out what the uh hold on e bindings I thought there was a hold button H hold position move freely change that to zero
there's a button I can actually push too. All right, everybody, attack it. Oh, shit. There we go. We got him. Okay, that's good. Believe it or not, though, that was still much easier than um, than my other runs. Most of my other runs, I ended up doing this fight like six or seven times or something like that. It was ridiculous. All right, let's see here. Go up to 28. We'll keep it pretty much 50-50. Time to go loot. Watch your step. That should do it.
Can't we talk? No. <laughs> Done. For better or not, the dwarf will be at the compound. Poor guy just kind of hiding in there. Guess we're gonna go to the docks and turn it in, huh? Got a few turn ins here. Vivi, <clears throat> <clears throat> so we're about to meet the Kunari Arashok, the leader. If you could do anything, just anything at all, what would you do? That's easy. Be normal. No magic. Just normal. Really? You wouldn't fly across Thedas or eat a cake the size of Kirkwall? Keep a baby griffin for a pet? <laughs> well, now that you say it, the Watch griffin might not be so bad. I'd near angry. mine. Feathers. Feathers. <laughs> Too cute. Let me pass. I have business with the Dwarf Javaris and your Arishok. The short mouth, yes. Enter if you must, Basra. Least understood group in Thetis, for certain. They have a strange sense of honor. Uh, honor. Very strange. Their society is basically people that are given roles at birth based on like I don't know. I don't know what it's based on. Probably based on their looks. Like if you're built like a warrior, your purpose is a warrior. And there are no individuals in Kunari society. And men and women are rele relegated to basically men and women roles. So you cannot be a warrior if you're a woman. Um, and they're very rigid with this kind of stuff. Like, um, like it's not the same as like in our society when they say, "Oh, you're a woman warrior." You know, it's not the same where there might be some sort of discrimination and stuff like that. With them, it's a little different. They'll say, you must not be a woman if you are a warrior. Then you are not a woman. You are a man. Like, to them, you are a man. It's kind of strange. It's very difficult to describe and explain. Alright, here we go. Actually, you know what? I think there's somebody else I'd ha rather have in my party right now. Just because of what I know about him. Let's actually get Fenris in here. Yeah. Fenris. I can actually level him up a little bit, too. Got a level, too.
All right, let's try it now. Ah, my right hand arrives. Summon your era, Shock. The bargain is done. About time you showed. I've been here for hours. Man, that's a big canary. And he's got extra horns. Ari Shokost, Maraz Shokra, Anan Isamkun. Look hewn from an elf? The madness of this place. Friend of yours? Friend of no one. Yes, well, that said, I'm here to report that your hated Talbashoth were felled, one and all, right? Yes, they were. So, I'm ready to open negotiations for the explosive powder, as we agreed. No. <laughs> He's not getting it. Make your chatty elf say something. Any insight that would help? Kunari, do not abandon a debt. I humbly request clarification from the Arishok. I have a growing lack of disgust for you. The dwarf imagined the deal for the Gatlock. He invented a task to prove his worth when he has none. Then we have wrongly inserted ourselves in your affairs. Would you have us kill this dwarf? Wait, what now? If you face Talvashoth, he is not worthy of dying to you, as he was not worthy of dying to them. But you, you keep good company. Ah. Let him live and leave. He had big plans for your recipe. I was supposed to get a piece of that. Dwarf, did your imaginary bargain make promises on my behalf? I uh, expected your wisdom to be more profitable. Then you will pay on my behalf. It's not at all. Take your coin, take whatever. Hornhead <laughs> oxmen and mongrel dawn lords, suck your own powder and blow your head off. Sod it. You will leave as well, human. There's no more coin for you here. Very cool. I thought for sure I'd get some sort of, uh,. You know, approval from increase from Fenris. Could level up our guys here. Four second paralysis. Still might be better to have this. This would come in handy for any rogues that try to attack. Break them out of stealth and stun them, I think.
kind of liking this magic damage that, that they had. Tempest is probably going to come in handy. Also this this is gonna this would be a really good one. Paralyzes foes and does a metric butt ton of damage. Tactics will use enemy rank a leader higher. Usability crushing prison. Take that up to the top. Not the top. There we go. A selfish lot. They would welcome purpose. Why do you bother me, human? The dwarf paid you. There is no more. Your kind thinks selfishness and want are normal. This city, all of it, leaves a bad taste. If you despise this place, why haven't you left? Since we arrived, I have seen nothing but greed and weakness. Dwarves, humans, elves, just... festering. No order, no goal. You are one of the few I have met with any ability. And yet this too was random, a result of selfishness. I cannot fathom how a mire like this can be justified. You say we should leave. But how can you bear to stay in this chaos? My welcome to the city was not so different from yours. And yet you suffer it. It's an opportunity to make a real difference. Karisten are soldiers. The Kuhn made it so. They can never vary from that assigned path, never be other than they are meant to be. But they are free to choose within that role, to accept and succeed, or deny and die. Glory is clear and defined. Could you, could not this entire city benefit from that certainty? How else will you know when you have made a real difference? Have you come here to proselytize? To convert? No. Foundering here was unexpected. I have purpose other than watching you rot. But... this city... How long must I let you harm yourselves? I suspect we are done, human. Hmm. How many Kunari have you lost to the Talvashov? None. Optimistic, considering my death toll. We lose nothing when weakness abandons the Kuhn. It is the Talvashoth who have lost themselves. I met an honorable one. Doubtful. He said he was a mercenary, not a murderer. Then I know he made no claim to honor. When they sell themselves, little remains. He is not even dead to the Kuhn. He is a living insult. Ah, <laughs> damn. I don't think Kirkwall would do well under military rule. The rule of the Kuhn is not military. It is discipline and order. How is that different? 
To your limited understanding, it is not. You fear soldiers that arrive to remove your pitiable vices. But they do not control Kunari. The Triumvirate divides and governs. One is nothing without the others. Can you tell me about the other two parts? No. Now you're just being difficult. I am no more equipped to explain than you are to understand. Ari Shock, Ari Gaina, Ari Kuhn. Pillars of the Kunari, of the nation that must be. There is but one way to know these things, human. And I have yet to decide if it must be done. You're a long way from home. Why did you come? To meet a demand of the Kuhn. Which was? It is a matter only the Kunari understand. We remain until we fulfill the demand of the Kuhn. Or until the demand changes. Do not ask that question. I don't think. I don't think that's gonna end well. Farewell. Panahedon, human. All right, this is a good spot to actually end it. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, like the video, subscribe to my channel. And we'll see you guys on the next video. Everybody have a good night.